I made 500k in bonuses alone last year. Shipped the whole lot offshore. Huh? Nice little haven in Belize. Say no more. So, uh, what do you do? I'm a tax inspector. Susan, darling. She's a beauty. No, I mean the golfing simulator, not your wife. Although you're very beautiful, too. Come on then, Tiger, let's see you drive. Jesus! Whoa! Need to watch that follow-through. Classic. It's all right, fine. This is Mr. and Mrs. Barker, soon to be my in-laws. This is Ollie, potential best man. Well, it's clear you're not a golfer, so what do you do? Ollie's a writer. Oh, what do you write? Would I know any of your work? Well, uh, ask Chris. He's read one of my books. I'm just gonna... excuse me. looking for? Ah, oh, I just thought I saw someone I recognized. No, you didn't. You were just pretending which I'd known to talk to. Like now. Are you in the habit of buying women's trousers? What make you say a thing like that? Because I have the same pair. <laughs> Lovely cut. Sadly, I only borrowed these from James because... They're my bloody trousers! And you ripped them! No, I don't think so. No, I mean... Got them from upstairs. I live here with Sarah. Who the hell are you? Ollie. <laughs> Ollie the best man. <laughs> James said you were funny, but I thought he meant funny ha-ha. Where is he? Pleasure to meet you. Hopefully meet again soon. <laughs> you will. I will. I'm the maid of honor. And don't you dare leave with my trousers. Who's this? Oh, you won't remember me. I'm just the guy I used to oh, live with. Murray, am I glad to hear your voice. Oh, sure. I can tell you're having a laugh with your new old best mate when I'm stuck yeah. at work. Trust me, I'm not. And you're not at work. You're in the pub. Has he thrown anyone out yet? <sighs> no, but strangely enough, no one has thrown up on him yet. Look, the truth is, I fell down the stairs. I nearly decapitated the father of the bride. And that's for the bridesmaid. Let's just say she could give Sylvia Plath a run for her money at the crazy games. But I can't say I didn't warn you. I can't wait to meet the bride. I'm gonna go. Please tell me you're not marrying James. Would it be such a bad thing if I was? It's not always a great idea to slug off the bride's entire family at her own party. Mm, I think you left her mother out. I was just coming to her. 